This is our 2007 Holden V Commodore and as part of its 300,000 km service I'm going to change the oil and filter and I'll show you how. You'll need 6.7 litres of 10W30 oil and a oil filter, in this case a Ryko R2605P. So this car's been extremely reliable and it's time for its 300,000 km service. Alright, so I've let the engine warm up a little bit, just let it idle for maybe five minutes and that'll help the oil to run out. And the next step, before we undo the drain plug, let's just take off the engine cover, like that, and that's where the oil filter is, and we'll just open up the oil fill and that'll just help the oil to flow out a bit easier. Now we have to undo the sump plug and then the oil will come out. Here's the sump plug, it was replaced at the 270,000 km service, you can see the rubber seal is intact, the head's pretty good so it's safe to use again. So while the oil is draining we can replace the oil filter, just there we go, could be a bit stiff. And there's the old oil filter. So here's the oil filter and the new one should come with an O-ring. It's a cartridge style oil filter and it doesn't matter which way it goes. So you just have to pull the old one out. Make sure you take off the old O-ring and then you're good to go. And just gently take off the o-ring. Put the new one on. Make sure it's in its groove properly. Done. Here's the inside. Still got a bit of oil, but it doesn't really matter. I'll put the new one in. There you go. Good to go. Alright, now before you put it in, it's just a good idea to get a bit of old engine oil. So just put it on the threads. And that way, it'll be a bit easier next time to take off. So that just goes back in there. Like such. Make it tight, but not too tight. You don't want to break it. There you go. That's how you replace the oil filter. Now it's time to put the sun plug back in and put new oil in. When that's done, just put the cap back on, like such, and put the cover back on. And maybe one last thing you could do is go into engineering mode and check your oil life, which is 5% at the moment. Now because we put fresh oil in, what we can do is reset it. So you actually have to turn the ignition on 
and then pump the accelerator three times and then turn it off and then go back into engineering mode and you'll see that it's set at 99% and last but not least we'll just start up the engine and just make sure that everything's alright All good. So that's how you change the oil and oil filter in your Holden Commodore.